Okay, I apologize for that. Um, for some reason, I'm not sure my entire recording device just got completely kicked off my computer, so I had to go reinstall it. We lost about 10 seconds of actual gameplay here, but it's pretty much just Roderick continuing to be a douchebag to our main character, Garrett. So, we're going to get right back into it. For all I know, we could be squires for life. All in wine around a fucking wedding. What a waste of fucking time. Give it time. You'll get there. Or easy for you to say. Maybe if my uncle were castling at House Forester, I'd feel different. Who my uncle is has nothing to do with it. How much further? Well, it's right over there. You're just giving me crap about being a pig farmer and now you're complaining that my uncle is somebody? What? I really don't like this guy. Take your time. You lot have drunk your share. Good thing Lord Walders. In a generous mood. Fucking phrase. Nice night for a wedding. Not often he finds hmm. a good husband for one of his daughters. Nothing ominous about that. Don't expect me to carry it for you, Sir Garrett. What? What's wrong? Just gotten into you. You're acting rather odd. You've had too much wine. We need to get back. Now. If I nick you don't see anything weird about this. You don't understand. We need to go. And take the fucking flagon already. What's wrong now. with him? Something the matter? Owen, we have to go. You're, You're the one that's acting suspicious, man. Come on. Sorry, Bowen. Warn the others. Good luck. Oh. Oh, quick time events. Forgot about those. in the morning. Oh. Oh. Damn. Uh, extra square. Oh. Well, that sucks. You guys had one job to do, you screwed it up. Yeah, thanks for the heads up, Oh, help. Up, left. Down. Triangle. Oh. That's one of those open ones. I hate those. Got it. Did you 
We should run. Right. Speak up, Garrett. Did you see him or not? He... He's gone, my lord. There was nothing I could do. Where's my squire? You didn't leave him, did you? What happened to him? Speak up, boy. I... I had to leave him. I had no other choice. Find a weapon. Quickly! What, are you gonna be shit about that now? Look, look, look where we're, we're at, man. Come on. Oh. Uh, yeah. Still time. Let's go. Come on. Uh, Robin Hood and Little John running through the forest. Seven hells. Come on, we get have moving. We to keep moving, my lord. I'd never make it. They'll hunt us down like dogs. All the braces, time to <gasps> Yeah, they'll hunt you down like dogs. We don't have much choice. You're gonna die either way. Guard this with your life. Return it to Ironrath, where it belongs. There's no time to waste. I'll be damned if I let it fall into the hands of those traitors. You have to traitorous throw. bastards. Welcome to the fucking I will do as you command, my lord. You have served me well. I know I can count on you. Tell your uncle. <laughs> Tell him. The North Grove Too easy. must never be lost. Tell no one but him. Do you understand? You must swear. Tell only your uncle Duncan. The future of the house may depend the on The North it. Grove, huh? I swear that I will, my lord. Hey, it's those foresters. Go. Oh, your honor, you must do this for your house. Go! Kill those fucking foresters! We love that oh. yeah, That is, this is the Red Wedding. Well, they're free. Has a lot of guys to take out all these damn bannermen for the Starks. Oh, I mean a TV intro. Oh, wait, well, I know it's a video game. You guys are stylizing this, but you couldn't just take the intro from the HBO show. The rendering of this one is pretty bad in comparison. So our journey begins in the long walk home. Where you get the sheaf that great sword from? Standard telltale interface. Can't do anything with the pig. Ooh, blood. Only good things can happen. Fresh. You have to touch it, you know it's blood. Uh. Is 
I don't know if they're making this because of all the they're doing this for all platforms, why not? But are they trying to do a stylus decision? But the art style is very subpar. You compare it to the uh, Walking Dead Telltale game and even the Tales from the Borderlands, which hopefully will be my next set of uh, let's be Tales from the Borderlands. I mean, I'm sure it's an artistic choice, but everything looks. I'm not trying to go up like a maybe like a watercolor pastel kind of thing, but everything just looks washed out. It's really kind of distracting. Very slowly, look at the car. That's father's car. How can you possibly tell that from here? Lord Bolton better give us fucking titles for this. That's a maybe common, but at least still have his bacon. <laughs> Hilarious. That's so you can tell boy. they're evil. There's nothing for you here. <laughs> Father. I said move on. Unless you want to get fed to the fucking pigs. Oh, you guys are... I'm going to kill you. Is that so? You can try if you like. And then we'll feed you to the pigs. Get. Off. My. Land. This is Bolton land now, boy. Lord Bolton is the new Warden of the North. I reckon he like a proper lordly sword like that. No. I'll have that sword, boy. Uh, God, this is... There we go. This guy's not so good with the great sword. Alright. Finish this fucking big farmer. Pathetic. Someone's got to swoop in and save him. Oh. Well, no, bitch for it. They are a pig farmer, up. <laughs> One down. <laughs> you know what the sword is, you know where he came from. You should know how what he survived already. Oh, dick! Mercy, please! I beg of you! I, I have a family! They'll never survive without me! I have no quarrel with you! I, I was oh. a bit more important. Damn it. Thank you. You can go, but the other guy, he is totally gonna die. Lord White Hill will see you hang for this. No, no, wait, Side no, points. kill him! <laughs> oh man. Father? Garrett, you survived. Your, your sister. Oh, she hid. Oh, thank God. Knowing this series, I was scared where that was going. I tried to stop them. I'll kill the men who did this. And now we load.
You haven't got treatment for your leg yet, man? Holy crap. Probably get infected or something. It's Garrett! Get the Castellan! Tell him his nephew survived! Okay, I'm gonna say, how the... He's his nephew. I'm like, how would you know who this guy is from that far away? He's just a squire, but the nephew makes sense then. Garrett! I was too late. They were already dead. Bring the maester! Meet us in the Great Hall! Quickly! Ah, these load times are... These, all this loading is atrocious. Two White Hill soldiers? And a Bolton. They killed my family. And for what? My sister, she... She was only eight beach. years old. This never would have happened with the Starks in power. It's unimaginable. Unacceptable. You have my condolences. Inconceivable. Thank you, Mister. Mm, the blade cut deep, but I should be able to save your leg. Your justice was Maybe. swift. Some will call it vengeance. No doubt the Whitehills will claim it was murder. It was your family. I can't say I would have done any different than you. But the White well, totally Elves see it that way. It was justice. They got what they deserved. They did indeed. We can't let the White Elves just walk all over us. These maggots ought to help prevent infection. Hold the wound open for me, would you? It's gonna make me do it, isn't it? Yeah. <sighs> These are dark days, I fear. To lose the lord of the house and the eldest son through such a despicable act of Ugh. treachery and betrayal. <sighs> Greater houses than ours have fallen in times such as this. The late Lord Forrester was a good man. And poor Roderick. A serious man, but he would have made a good lord. Our house will never fall. By the gods, let's hope you're right. The future of this house is in Lord Ethan's hands now. Although he is young. And altogether unprepared to lead. Right. As a protagonist, uh, I'll have no shape in this whatsoever. This might hurt a bit. Means you're hurt like hell. Me, will you? I understand from your uncle that Lord Forrester saved your life. He did. Rather odd, though, that he chose to save you, his squire, and not his son, Roderick. Not that Roderick couldn't handle himself. He was as good with a sword as any man I've seen. It's unfortunate the Citadel doesn't train maesters in the art of warcraft. I imagine I'd be pretty good with a sword. He gave me a message to deliver. A message? About what? What did he tell you? Get my uncle. I was told only to tell him. Your uncle? I see. Must be rather important then. Lady Forrester will be here any moment now. I'd like you to walk for me first. To see if you I can like put this any guy. weight on that leg. But this is a song of fire advice. I can't trust him yet. Go on. Don't There's stop now. It's better to let the blood circulate. Maggots are really doing their job. Okay, let's see. Look at medical supplies. Rather cute little creatures, aren't they? I guess. It's a bucket full of maggots. This might help. I guess he won't be needing them. Oh, thank God! If you were—I was going to say—but let me take the the plant, but not the bandage. That's that's bad. Seriously, I can just take all this stuff and go. All right. Hmm. You seem to be favoring it. Always sad to see a warrior lose a leg. I, I'm fine, Miss. Let's see, Asher. 
Exiled to Essos, unfortunately. Talia and Ethan. I suppose Lord Ethan now. Mira. Still in King's Landing, I suppose. Although, I wonder if they'll bring her home. Lady Forrester. She's always been kind to me. Treated me like I was a Forrester myself. Well, like, well, if he's his uncle on his mother's side, then I guess it wouldn't be technically a forester, but Ryan. still. Never easy being a fourth born son. That can't be a common expression. Lord Forrester, it was an honor to squire for him. Gregor the Good. Roderick, he was our best warrior by far. Even he got taken out. Mm -hmm. All right, be before the doing exploring, I'm going to stop this right here and pick it up next it. time. So, thanks for tuning in. I'll see you next episode.